and we bought it some kind of, I don't know what you call it, but it was sweet syrup. And we would pour some of that sweet syrup in that gallon bucket and we had some fine, cold summertime eating. our 100th year anniversary, our birthday, if you will, for the city of Gonzales. How great a day is this? I mean, it is beautiful outside. We've got a wonderful crowd here at T.J. Uh, Museum, and we're very excited to just carry on throughout the weekend. Community coming together and sharing special stories and learning about some history we, we haven't heard or, or learned, and the same sharing with the community, our story at ETEL becoming Rev. I uh, have a lot of people that have sort of approached us and are really, you know, not only Team Etel, but Team Rev now to really see this company continue to flourish and, and grow and expand. Knowing that there's some family history here on the 100th anniversary, and let me tell you, this, the mayor, the, the council, the leaders in this parish, the sheriff, they just all pull together in the same direction. You get excited about coming to Gonzales. And, and working with the people for whatever project it is. So I'm, I'm really honored to be here tonight. You know, people are here not only to celebrate a hundred year history of Gonzales, but really celebrating community and the history of that community and really with a, also with a forward look. You know, lots of conversations today with some of our, our lo local civic leaders about what the future holds for Gonzales and for the community. So, yes, you know, rooted in history, a lot of those stories, but also a very much forward look and how we continue to grow and prosper. And tonight's event is sponsored by Rev. So we're very happy and pleased with that. And let's say it, it used to be Etail, who's been here for years and years. I kind of grew up with Etail. So, uh, we can't, we can't thank you guys enough. It's been great to have you a part of Gonzales, and we hope we go another 100 years. Mm -hmm.